Hello everyone, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel before you do anything else. And if you're watching my channel, you know that I'm obsessed with painting clothes now. So I've done a lot more. So I want to show you some of the pieces that I've done. So these pens are by William Rass, which is the, like the Justin Timberlake brand. And I added like skulls that look like grenades and flowers. I also put the picture so you can see it of me wearing them. So they're really cool. And with this, I, I did like a combination of spray paint, acrylic, paint and in sharpie markers and I like to wear really short shorts so <laughs> these are really short and it's like florals florals for spring groundbreaking right this is also with spray paint and acrylic paint but what I do first and I think that's helped me because I've heard a lot of people who do paint clothes with acrylics like it washes off but I do a gesso layer first and then I paint on top of the gesso so the acrylic paint adheres to it and I think that's what helps from not washing off the paint. Also these are like abstract flowers and with these I did acrylic paint but I also got these things at Hobby Lobby which I love. They're called scribbles and it's like 3D fabric paint. Really cool stuff and you can just like write with it or add little dots or designs and that's kind of like what I did here. just traced around the flowers. And I'm obsessed with owls. I love, love owls. So then I created these. They're really cool and if you follow me on Instagram, you'll be able to see more pictures of like all this stuff that I have done. Uh, I'll leave a, my Instagram name below so you can see it. But yeah, with these, I did a lot of the, with the 3D paint. So it's kind of like three-dimensional when you touch it. It's pretty cool. I love, love owls. And then these are my absolute favorite. It's uh, overalls, but they have flames. Like in the crotch area, fire crotch. <laughs> and up here. So I'll show you the picture, you can see what it looks like. But these are my absolute favorite. I'm gonna do a lot of pieces with flames. And I'm actually working on one. I'm gonna show you how I started off first with the gesso base. So I draw it first with the black sharpie and then I go back and add the gesso. And I think that's what helps the acrylic paint stay on because it's like a canvas. The thing is we wash it, wash it inside out and use cold water. Like I said, I love having water on the test and, I, and I'm so stupid, I don't even know why I didn't, it, it didn't even occur to me that there's paints for fabric. I just started painting with acrylic because that's what I had laying around here. But then I got this kit that I'm gonna try out. I guess the brand is Tula, but it's a lot of uh, colors. It's pre-washed fabric, no fabric softener. Insert Tula fashion form on cardboard between layers of fabric. Shape will apply one to two coats using brush, sponge, stamp, or stencil. Dry flat for four hours. Fabric can be washed, turned inside out after 72 hours. So it takes a while for it to adhere. And since I'm doing a lot of flames, I bought, you know, the colors that I would need for them. So red, orange, and yellow. And it's the same brand, it's just bigger version. So I'm gonna do these with this paint and see what the difference is versus the acrylic I did on that. So yeah, I'm excited to try these out. These are $5.99 each. So they're not cheap. And then this little starter pack was $21, but with the 40% discount coupon that you get if you have the Hobby Lobby app, good pricing. I love Hobby Lobby and I love that app. Also got these 3D fabric paints, which I'm assuming are very similar to these. And this was $6.99. So I'm also gonna try those out. And of course I like Master's Touch, Master's Touch brushes. For the more detailed parts. I like to use old brushes and the like for the preliminary stuff and then once I'm doing like the final touches and I like to use a brand new brush that hasn't been frayed or anything like that. So yeah, I'm super excited to paint more clothes and like I said, follow me on Instagram so you can see everything that I'm doing. And if you want one of these, well DM me and I can ship it for you. Obviously for a price, a very small price. Thank you so much for watching. My Instagram name by the way is Amar Con Locura. I know it's long but it'll be down here so you can pause the video and copy it down and then go look me up. Please subscribe, share, like, and take a look at my other content in my channel. Uh, there's a lot of great stuff in there so please watch and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Until next time, adios y bye.